guys, we're starting off the day with a package from Sam's Club. Hmm? What the heck? What the heck is right? Why did Sam's Club send me a package? It's kind of weird. And it's really hard to open. It's because you have to keep trying something. Oh, I don't know why it's in a Sam's Club box, but it's diapers which we really needed. Actually, I think Wesley is out of this size and we need to move up to the next size because Wesley's getting so big. It's just diapers, guys. Just diapers. Mm -mm, mm -mm, Do you think mm -mm, you have any more packages? Should we look? Hi guys, so I don't think I've filmed anything yet today except for that one little clip of me Um, what well, whatever I was doing, I was opening a package Anyway, I got more packages, so you have that to look forward to The few of you that like watching me open packages But I uploaded the like little new video today on my main channel Of like, it's like a mini documentary It's a, just a 15 minute video, but it's kind of like documentary style Kind of following me through my day on a chaotic day on tour So if you haven't seen that, please go check it out I really like the video and it's just a different style than what I normally do So I hope you guys like it But yeah, today I was working on that and then I'm doing the vlog now. The babies had a doctor's appointment this morning and they're very grumpy. The doctor's appointment made them grumpy. And so they have been kind of a wreck today, just like really sad. And Wesley is so close to having his top four teeth pop through. You can see them all under the gum, like swollen. Like you can see the whites of the teeth just underneath the gum. And he's just been a disaster. So we've been dealing with that all day and it's been hard, but everything is good. Just trying to live and survive the day. I've just been playing piano for little Mr. Wes and little Miss Maisie over here. And Flynn just got home from the store and he got himself a hat and he's putting it on Maisie. <laughs> Maisie, that's so cute. <laughs> Flynn, that's a bit, yeah, it looks so cute. You, see you gotta hat, see, it's so like... cute. What do you think? What do you think? Do you like the piano? Do you like the piano? Yeah, baby. They've yeah. been very grumpy, so I was like, we're gonna try to listen to some music, and it's kind of working. They stopped screaming for a second. and got me a surprise? Forever 21? You went to Forever 21, Flynn? Picked you out a whole outfit. Flynn picked out an outfit for me? You picked yeah. this out? Flynn picked me out an outfit. <gasps> oh, oh, Maisie didn't like that. Wow, look at this. Cool, a cowboy hat? It's a cowboy hat or is it a bug catching hat? It's a bug catching hat. Love Wesley. Wesley's trying to look in the back. He's trying to sneak a peek. Thanks for my hat. What else did you get? You want me your next Oh, ho, 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 ho. cool shorts. These are so cute. Thank you, a little jean short moment. Wow, thanks for my cute outfit. Wait, no, there's one more thing I forgot. <gasps> a grabber. Is that for you, Flynn, or for mommy? It's for me. It's for you. Can I see? Flynn really likes grabber claws. These are very trendy right now, but Flynn really likes them because they remind him of like construction trucks. It's a grabber. <laughs> And I guess they got me an outfit. So I didn't get anything for myself. Though. You didn't? <gasps> oh my gosh, that's a big, another one? Gee Louise, what'd you guys get? Mm. Holy smokes. What'd you get? What's the, ooh, a jean jacket. This is fun. Cute. I oh. love that. Oh, ooh, and my shorts, thank you. That's cool. You picked those out for me? Yeah, Flynn heard that like flares were in. Oh gosh. Flares! Look at these. Oh, these are bell bottoms. And look, a Dua Lipa top. Oh, that's cute, actually. Oh, that's to go under the jean jacket. Wes is eating it, is that okay? I didn't know that's so size. cute, I love that. Okay, go get Thank the Thank you for my outfit, that was so cute. You can't have an outfit without shoes. Shoes too? Oh, Doc Martens. Cute. Oh, these are so cute. Oh my gosh, look at that. Flynn knows fashion. Amazing, wow, I got spoiled for no reason today. Thank you guys, you're the best ever. Now try it on fashion show. Try it on fashion show. <gasps> we want to try it on fashion show. Let's see if you just pooped in my lap. Oh, uh, Maisie just pooped in your lap? Yeah. Holy smokes, that's a great thing. Yeah. She really needed to poop. We gotta do a fashion show and clean up poop. See y'all later. How's the OOFTD? O-O-T-D. Oh. 
What do we think? Did Flynn do a good job? I think so. I think those are gonna look really cool broken in. If I did a spin, I mean, I would, you know, you like spin. I can't spin, you will see my tariness. So maybe if you go from an up angle, I can turn around for yeah. you, but. Don't look at the anus. I can't see it. What do you think? Am I ready for Coachella? Am I ready to go to a festival? Thanks for my outfit, lovey. These shoes are so cool. Oh my God, I just put on the flares. You have to see this. Like I'm ready for a disco. I know flares are in, but this is a straight up bell bottom. Like that's a lot. Da, 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 da. A couple more packages, guys, but I'm smelling something funky. You wanna do it with me? Okay, I'll wait for you. I gotta wait till Flynn's done with dinner. I think someone pooped over here anyway. Okay, Flynn is done with his dinner. So you can help me open these packages. Mama, what? these shoes are dope. No, she's our dope. Ah, I got a lip stain that was recommended on TikTok, of course, and I wanted to try it. I saw so, a few different people talk about this lip stain, and I feel like my lips always look chapped and dry and crusty and musty and dusty, so I was like, you know what, maybe a lip stain is the thing for me. The matches, look! They do match, that's makeup for me. This one, I don't know what the heck's in here. You surprised me. <laughs> Oh, it's Ari. Ari's new makeup. That's my friend Ariana. Can you say Ariana? Ariana. Her other name is Queen. Can you say Queen? Queen. Queen. Yeah, Queen Ariana. Legend icon. Legend icon. Yes. Oh, yeah. oh this is so exciting. Ignore my disgusting band-aid fingers. Oh my gosh. <gasps> wow, gorgeous. Look at all of this. What a beautiful display. Oh, Wesley wants to see. Wesley, look. This is what it looks like, Wes. Do you like it? Looks good, huh? Looks like it's a bunch of lips things, which is great. Can I check? You wanna check? Sure. That's a lip gloss. Isn't it pretty? I'm assuming it's a lip gloss. Isn't that pretty? And it looks like, are these liners? Yeah, the lip liners. Oh my gosh, how exciting. I can't wait to go through all this stuff. I got so much lip stuff. Okay, Wesley, you can try it too. You can try it too. Gotta go. Hey y'all, it's like 10 p.m. Come along with me while I make my current obsession. I've only had it a couple times, but for some reason I'm really enjoying it. I basically make a really cheap, gross version of like a buffalo chicken wrap. So I'm air frying some chicken tenders and I'm cutting up a cucumber and I'm gonna cut up a piece of celery. And I just put celery, cucumber, and chicken strips in our tortilla with red hot sauce, like wing sauce, and with ranch. And then I dip it in ranch. And for some reason I'm like really obsessed with this lately. So that's what I'm making for dinner at 10 p.m. Um, but I wanted to tell you something cute that Flynn has been saying lately and I just wanna remember it forever, so I'm saying it so that I remember it forever. For some reason, yesterday morning, Flynn woke up and he was like running around. I asked him a question and I don't remember what the question was, but he goes, never what I would do. And I said, what? And he goes, never what I would do, mama. Never what I would do. And I was like, where did that come from? What does that mean? And he didn't know what it meant. He didn't tell me what it meant, but he just kept saying it about like everything. And then he started saying it to Corey when Corey got here. He'd just be like, never what I would do. And it, every scenario in which he said it was so funny. I don't know what it means, but I love it. And so we've just started trying to say it as much as possible, but I don't want to forget it because it's, I don't know why it makes me laugh so hard and going never what I would do. Another thing he did tonight that I thought was so cute that I wanted to tell you guys about is that with Flynn, the way I kind of like help him learn better behavior from bad behavior, like for example, if he gets excited or upset or whatever, and he like bangs on the couch, hits on the couch, or like comes up and kind of like punches my legs or something like that, I don't go like, oh, don't hit. I say, oh no, it seems like you hit the couch or like, oh no, I think you just hit me. And then I say, that's not something nice that we do with our hands. I will not let you hit me. So what are some nice things we can do with our hands? You can hug with your hands. You can give high fives with your hands, you can give thumbs up with your hands, you can clap with your hands, what else can you use your hands? And then he'll say things like, I can hold a hermit crab, you know, like he'll say what he can do with his hands. I'm like, these are all great things you can do with your hands, these are great choices. But hitting is not a good choice, we're not going to hit with our hands, you know, things like that. And I do that often with him, like um, if he's angry and he goes like, mm, I'd be like, oh it sounds like you're angry, are you angry? And he'll say yes or no or whatever. And I'll be like, you know, another thing you can do is you can say, I'm angry right now. And you can use your words, or you can, if you need to do something with your hands, 
hands, you can cross your arms and say, I'm angry, or put your hands on your hips, I'm frustrated. You can try one of those things instead of just growling. You know, like I explain things at that time. So tonight, he was in his bed reading a book with Eric, and they were like cuddling and reading a story, and I walk in, and I go, oh, can I come and read a story with you? And he goes, yeah, mama, you, you can come in, you can come in. I go, oh, great. But I had just given all the kids like a bath in the shower, like all three of them, we were all in the shower, and I had their little tubs in the shower, and so I wasn't wearing a shirt, like I was wearing just a bra and like my shorts, because um, my shirt got wet. And so I said, oh, you know what? I just realized I'm not wearing a shirt. Let me go put a shirt on and then I'll come back. And he goes, oh, no, 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 mama. Instead, you can say, um, never mind. I changed my mind. I'll be right back. Or you can say, just kidding. I'm not going to do that. I'll be right back. Or you can say, I'm gonna go get a shirt. Then I'll come lay here. <laughs> that <laughs> gave me options of other things to say. Um, and I just thought it was so cute. And also it just made me go like, oh, so he's like soaking in when I do that for him, which made me happy too, but it was very, very cute. Anyway, I just wanted to tell those little Flynn stories before I forgot, so it was very cute. So anyway, I cut up my celery, I cut up my cucumber, and um, my chicken is heating up in here and getting nice and crisp. And then I'm gonna put it all in the wrap with these things and eat it and it'll be delicious. Okay, I've made it, but unfortunately we only have literal cardboard not actual food tortillas. Eric ordered low carb, healthy, organic paper. <laughs> and like, as you roll it, it just like crumbles. It's like not even real. Maybe you're supposed to like microwave it for 10 seconds. Maybe you're supposed to microwave an organic, healthy tortilla in order for it to taste good. Like soften Anyway, it's not good, but I haven't tried it. I just tried a bite of the tortilla, but I haven't tried a bite of this. So let's try it. <gasps> hmm. It's not good. Does it say Santa Barbara on this? What are you, why are you taking that away from me? It says Oakland. Juice was invented in Santa Barbara. Ranch dressing was not invented in Santa Barbara. Yeah, Hidden Valley Ranch. It was invented in Santa Barbara. No, it wasn't. You just made that up. Was it really? You act like you know. This is expired. Ranch doesn't expire. It, this one is expired. It won't even come out. Hello? Oh! It's expired. You can relax. Colleen and Eric have a podcast. The world is scary and we're locked in our home. But now we have big microphones. So you can relax. That's the name of our podcast.